When I came to Dieter's Hearty first, I couldn't net a loop. I didn't know how to net. But Wally's mother took me in hand and she learned me. And I finished up doing fisherman's jerseys, fisherman's drawers, and sea boot stockings. That's one word. So the fisherman's jerseys you did, were they the only set pattern? Uh, no, no, nearly mm -hmm. no. You you could make you could make a part. They, they, they made their own patterns. Mm -hmm. the, the fisher folk made their own patterns. Mm -hmm. But to put to put you in the picture, a a gamery ganzi was not made like a rosette ganzi. Mm -hmm. And different patterns. Mm -hmm. Different patterns, different ways in doing it. Mm -hmm. And there's hearty, there's hearty patterns and things was in the same as Cairnbrook patterns. Everybody just sort of a pattern of their own to, to fold it. Can you tell us something about the patterns that you worked? Can you tell us something no. about the fit format? That there you? could have been a rope pattern. It, mainly, mainly rope. And there could have been yeah, Diamond. fern tree, uh, fern leaves. Oh, right. you know, leaves, the fern branches. And a diamond. And diamond. Diamond. So were, were the rope, was the rope in a dune part? Uh, yes, 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 she came for, she came for up, she came for dune, up. Uh, and the, the, the ferns were the same? The the the, they they, they, they no. spread across the, across the way. They, they spread across the way, the ferns. The chest, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But uh, the, the drawers, the worst of drawers, were made just plain, plain knitting, no mm -hmm. fancy knitting. Mm -hmm. But it, it had its snags. Mm -hmm. so it was the snags? Well, <laughs> you had to have the right amount of loops on to fit the body, because mm -hmm. everybody's body, every man's body was a different size. Mm -hmm. So you had to fit your loops on to, to, to suit the body. Everybody's leg, every man's leg was in the same size, so you had to fit your leg to suit your man, or whoever you knit and tell. Mm -hmm. uh, I could imagine there would be a lot of difficulties with that, but there would be no difficulties with the socks, was there? Uh, well, bigger feet. Some, mm. same, some have bigger feet than others, but the length, the length usually is a sock. You just made it according to the size of the man. Mm -hmm. If you not if you not a twenty mile uh, rows on that, you put twenty mile rows on that, mm -hmm. and you just knew it's your it's your mm -hmm. You just come to, to you just come to, to Ken, be your, the knowledge it just picking up, just how much loops you needed, mm -hmm. and how you went about it. And how do you get your wool? In the shops. Just the shops. Oh, in the shops. In the shops. Yeah. Uh, there's other shops. It's, 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 I got my. Drapery shops. Mm -hmm. Ah, the drapery shops. I them here and add them sort. A palms and add them sort. Was it a thicker type of wool you used for fishermen's gansies and fishermen's drawers oh, and fishermen's socks? Uh, Are the same type of wool as that? Same type of wool as this. Hmm. So fit type of wool as that. Has it got a name? Quillen. Wheeling. Wheeling. Wool. Wheeling wool. Mm. That's what they, that's what they, the drawers are in it, we. But your, your, your jumpers are in it, we, a wee bit of fine, that's wool. So is that the same wool, the day, that you can buy the day, that you were using then? That's the wool. Mm -hmm. It's been undone out of a pair of drawers. Is that right? Uh -huh. And now I'm knitting them for the Nigerian burdens. That's good. To my blankets. For the Nigerian parents. That's very good. And have you got any patterns? You never got any examples of a pattern that you've done on fishermen's gansies, not? No? no, really. No, no I like fishermen's gansies.